Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Christo Sama. We are here playing Resistance Fall of Man, and this is part four. Uh, yeah, let's get started. Why do I have a gun? So it might sound kind of weird to you guys, but I totally remember this part from whenever I played. I'm pretty sure this is the one with like the locusts, and you'll see what I mean eventually in this game. Oh hi! Yeah. Note to self. Note to blood. Okay. Yeah, I see that. You know what, just real quick. Okay. Hmm. Cool. Sergeant Hale, First Rangers. An American? We thought the Chimera stopped all of you in York. Chimera? Those creatures. Oh, you jammed it. I'm sorry, Hale. Looks like you'll have to find your own way out. I'll be in touch. Frequency 77.6. It was strange enough that a lone American soldier was walking around a Khmeran conversion center, but it was his eyes that were most disturbing. They showed unmistakable Khmeran traits. It was subtle, but it was there. Whoever Nathan Hale was, he wasn't entirely human. Da! Anyway. So... Those were the locusts that I was talking about, by the way. She looks so weird and creepy. Okay. So, a little bit more about this game. Uh, it came out in 2006, PS3, bestseller, blah blah blah. Um, God, I'm so strong! Anyway, um. Okay. Um, don't mess with explosives, children. Um, supposedly, uh, Resistance 2 was the better, uh, game in this, in, uh, all the series. There's, it's a, you know, there's three games. Um, oh, you have guns. You have guns. Not cool. Wasn't expecting it. I hate you. Go away. Go away to regen. Alright. Um... But uh, I was thinking about getting the entire trilogy, and I uh, wasn't exactly sure how it would go, how it would fare on my channel and everything. Plus, I've only ever played this first game, uh, so I think I'm just going to stick with this one. Unless you guys want it, if you want more, you know, you can comment and message me or whatever it is you want to do. Oh, you're over here. Run in blindly, it's the best option. Um, switch. Switch. Going up the elevator! Halo 3 had a really awesome uh, elevator scene at the end of Crow's uh, Nest. Yeah. 
Learning. I like it. Oh god. Oh, I don't have to kill one of those later. And if I do, it better be badass. Oh, what am I kidding? Definitely gonna be badass. Alrighty. Switch? No. Can't go through here. Okay. Can I... Okay, I'll drop down. Ooh, hi. So this game has a little bit of horror element to it. Not entirely, like, they aren't super going for it. But, uh... It, like, just enough, you know? Like the locust thing? That was pretty cray. So I'm pretty sure I have to, like... Crouch. Whoa, what, 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 what? what? Where? I heard it. I don't see it. Is that one of them? Oh god. Okay. Cool. Hedgehogs, huh? What? So this is what I'm talking about. Disparges both barrels. Alright, cool. The ultimate contingency plan. Shotgun to the face. Okay. Follow the lights. Where in the bloody hell do I go? <laughs> Come on now. That'd be a bitch. That's where I came from. Bro, come on. Give me some. It has to be obvious. Okay. <laughs> Obvious enough. What are you? Punch. No. Okay. God, I love shotgun. Alright. You're dead. Because I killed you. Just gonna go with the bullseye for now. Until I get really close quarters. And it's better for killing these things. So, yeah. You scared me. Oh, shake. Right. Shake. Damn it. So the humans are the ones without the lights in front of their back. And they don't have guns, and they have terrible aim. Anything? Ammo? Nothing? Okay. Why would that aliens have human ammo? Whatever. I kinda wanna use one of these new I don't really have much to use it on. Oh, hi.
Reverse mode is YOLO mode. Alright, well. Not what I meant to do. birds and I was like, those aren't the things that shoot me. I thought if I crouched it would just let me be. No? No. Okay. The transmission center was built on top of an old fish cannery. Networks of tubes transported the bodies from one stage of conversion to another. Once humans are infected by the Chimeran virus, they fall into a coma. The virus begins changing their bodies from the inside out, eventually turning them into one of the Chimeran creatures. The conversion centers simply speed up the process. Well, yeah, we'll eventually become Kimarin. Alright, well, this has been Chris Osama, and uh, thanks for watching part four? Four. Totally four. Might be five. I'm not gonna lie, because I don't remember and I'm really tired. So, uh, I gotta go. So, see y'all in the next episode. Uh, bye.